In this video, we'll discuss how to move around in a 3D view. We'll start by creating a couple of camera views, and then we'll talk about the various tools we can use to navigate in those 3D views. And finally, we'll discuss camera focal points and focusing on specific objects and areas of the home. So here in my plan, I'll start by creating a 3D view. I can find my camera tools here on my toolbar. I'm going to open two different 3D views today. First, I'll select a full overview, which will place me outside the home. And I'll keep this view open and select this tab at the top of my screen to toggle back to my plan view. Now I'm going to choose a full camera, which lets me place myself somewhere specific in the home. I'll move my mouse into the plan and click and drag in the direction that I want to look, and it will open a camera view from that perspective. When a new camera opens, it will automatically have the Mouse Orbit tool selected. You can tell because my cursor looks like the Orbit tool. This allows me to use my mouse to click and drag to rotate around in my view. When I select another tool, the Orbit tool is dropped. I can select it again up here in my toolbar under the Parent tool, Move Camera with Mouse. As you can see, there are a few other navigation tools here as well. Mouse Pan allows me to pan around my 3D view without rotating. Mouse Dolly Camera lets me use my mouse to click and drag forward or back to move forward and back, or left and right to move side to side. Mouse Tilt keeps me standing in the same place, but allows me to rotate around from that spot. Three Day Center Camera on Point will adjust my position so that the place that I click will be centered in my view. And 3D Focus on Object allows me to select any object in my plan, and the camera will zoom in and center the camera on that object. If I want to zoom out again, one way to do that is through the Zoom tools in my display toolbar on the right of my screen. I'll select to zoom out. You can also use your arrow keys to move around in the plan. Using your up arrow will move you one foot forward, the down arrow will move the camera one foot backward, and left and right arrows will rotate your camera 10 degrees. One other method to move around in 3D is to use the scroll wheel on your mouse. For this reason, we highly recommend using a mouse that has a scroll wheel when working in Chief Architect, because this is the most convenient way to move in 3D. If I roll the scroll wheel forward, I can zoom in on my view and move the camera forward. If I roll the scroll wheel backward, I can zoom out and move back in my 3D view. If I push down on the scroll wheel, I can pan around. And if I hold down the Alt key while I push down on the scroll wheel, I can rotate around my view. These options are particularly handy because they do not require dropping the tool that I have activated in order to move the camera into a different position. For instance, if I select an outlet and decide that I want to place the outlet on the wall behind me in 3D, if I select the Orbit tool and rotate, notice I have dropped the outlet. But if I select the Outlet tool again, then select Alt while I hold down my scroll wheel to rotate, I keep the Outlet tool active. Now if we look at the tabs at the top of my screen, I have multiple views open. I can toggle to any of these views, or I can click and drag on these tabs to move them around and have multiple views open at a time. I can also accomplish this by going to my Window menu and selecting Tile Views Vertically or Horizontally. I want to have my plan view open alongside my camera views so that we can take a look at our focal points and understand what happens to the camera as we zoom in and out on our plan. The focal point is the area at the end of the camera that is what the camera is centered on. If I select the focal point in my plan view and move it to a different position, you can see how that affects my camera. 
Now if I select that camera view and use my orbit tool, you can see that the camera is rotating around that point. Looking closer at the full overview then, you can see that it placed the focal point right in the center of my plan. To make it so we can seamlessly rotate around the plan and see its exterior. If I use my scroll wheel to zoom in on this plan, the distance to the focal point changes. Once I zoom all the way into that focal point, now when I orbit around, I don't move around the outside of the home, but instead it's as if I'm standing in one spot in the home and rotating to look at all views from that point. And if I continue to use the scroll wheel, now it functions to move me forward in the plan. Now watch what happens if I drag the focal point away from the camera in my plan view, then use my orbit tool in 3D. Now this point is where the camera will rotate around and it will create a wider arc around it. Knowing all of your options to navigate in 3D will help you be more efficient in your design process. Chief Architect has multiple ways to adjust your 3D view. Through Move Camera with Mouse tools in the 3D menu or on your toolbar, using your arrow keys on your keyboard, and using the scroll wheel on your mouse.